channel. So this video is exclusively for class 8 students, those who are attending the board examination. So I already have three practice papers na, uh, upload my channel uh, for a science subject. So mathematics subject na nimge train madake board examination ge. So in the kalavai dinagalali maths videos kuda deepa madam upload madare. So we support for both maths and science even for class eight students board examination. Okay. So saying so much. So yaradru first time channel visit madare. If you have not yet watched the previous three practice papers, so adra playlist nimge channel ali ida. So watch the playlist and the playlist ke ogi ne click madi. Ali si guvanta three practice papers na complete agi watch madi examination ki prepare ag bodo okay so already also have received the timetable so nimge 13th of march in the examinations start after that so you all know that uh, we all are supporting for your uh, upcoming board examinations so do utilize the uh, benefits which you are getting nim gain benefits ikta ida adana utilize maadkondu exam ki prepare agi fine so nalaku practice papers na ivattige nan fourth paper maartta idini Nalaku practice paper na yar complete ag watch madir tare. Niwo face madu vanta school level examinations agir bodo. Atwa board examinations definitely you can crack. Na very good marks. Okay. Yes. The first question. Okay. It's already been answered by one of the student. Fine. So very good. So the first question is which of the following works on the concept of multiple reflections anta? Ani ni kail tai dini. The options are telescope, binocular. Kaleidoscope and sunglasses. So the right answer is already given by a student. Yes, the right answer is option C. So let me look at the name of the student who has given the first answer. That is Hamid. Yes, very good. So fine. Uh, you already know. Ni mildo ko already na explain maar di ni board ali. Ni mge provide maar wanta question paper he girete anta. So you are you all are familiar with that, right? So let us look at some of the questions uh, for your board examinations. So the right answer for the first question is option C. Agade. Option C is the right answer. That is kaleidoscope. Kaleidoscope is the right answer. The next question is the next question is we can see ourselves in a mirror or a polished surface, but not on the walls because of. Why? We can see ourselves in the mirror. Okay, but we cannot see. Uh, ourselves on a polished surface what is the reason for this you have to identify okay the options here are irregular reflections normal reflections irregular uh, reflection i think uh, two times the option has been repeated and the fourth option is the specular reflection because of what you cannot see yourself on the polished surface okay the right answer here is option a children option a that is due to irregular reflection See, due to irregular reflection, you cannot see yourself on a polished surface. Okay. You cannot see yourself on a polished surface because of irregular reflection. So, moving to third question. See, the poverty of a, sorry, the property of a plane mirror to make the right up, appears as left and vice versa is called dash. The property of the plane mirror that makes the right appears as left and also vice versa mean left appears right. So what do we call that? Options are vertical inversion, lateral inversion, option C reflection and op option D is refraction. Okay. So the right answer you can also try to answer here. The right answer here is option B that is due to lateral inversion. So now you can solve mark the papers. Papers na follow the papers. Exam only complete agi marks in a new particle body. I can read textbook nali nim gain ala important in the yellow one no kuda nano. You go fourth practice paper in almost past three practice papers in an include margin. So, this will be definitely going to help for your examinations. So, here the right answer is due to lateral invasion. So, right things appears as left and left things will appear as right. Let's go for next question. The next question is students. The space between the cornea and the lens is filled with the liquid called as. What kind of liquid is been filled between the space of cornea and lens? Options are A, aqueous humor, B, retina, C, optic nerve, D, none of the above. The right answer is again given by one of the student. So that is option A, aqueous humor. Okay, aqueous humor 
this is the liquid which is present between the cornea and also the lens so let's go for next question students see find the name of the constellation look at this constellation if you look at this constellation so you can easily guess there is also a picture behind okay yes the options are orion leo major great bear and cassiopeia there is a hint actually looking at the picture you can find out it is option b this picture is leo major this picture is representing the leo major okay yes so let's go for next question i think you are also trying to answer so please guess the answers okay yes the next question the first okay the sixth question is the tail of a comet is always directed away from sixth question the tail of the comet is always directed away from options are asteroid comet meteorite and sun okay so the tail of comet is always directed away from the sun so the right answer is option d it is sun the next question the first indian artificial satellite options are aryabhata kalpana 1 insat 1a vsat 3 of course all these are indian satellites only artificial satellite among this which is the first indian artificial satellite so the right answer is option a aryabhata aryabhata is the first indian artificial satellite okay so moving to next question the eighth one the following object help the scientist in investigating the nature of the material from which the solar system was formed options are meteorite asteroid star and comet yen kelta idareli yava object which object is helping the scientist to investigate the nature of material so solar system yavudrinda model pattide anta yav material information kodtide anta kelta idare okay the right answer here is option a meteorite okay meteorite will tell meteorite is the object it will tell so what is the nature of the uh, what is that solar system anta helutte this materials will tell about the solar system moving to next question name the device that can be name the device that can be used to test whether an object is carrying the charge or not okay options are electroscope periscope microscope and none of the above so which is going to help to find uh, whether the object is carrying the charge or not only one student is answering very good i appreciate your effort the right answer is option a electroscope is a device okay those students who are finding difficult so you can note down these questions find out the answer which very important for you so device which help to find whether an object is carrying charge or not is option a electroscope next question number 10 the rod which provides easy route for the transfer of electric charge to the ground is so this question i have asked in three different ways from past four question paper nalaku question paper alli bere bere reethi kelidini right the rod which provides easy route for transfer of electric charge to the ground the right answer here is option a that is lightning conductor there are four option lightning conductor erding wire richter scale and metallic rod the right answer is option a that is the lightning conductor okay this lightning conductor he is helping to provide the easy route of transfer of electric charge to the ground so this how this is how you are you are going to write the answer there it in exam only option sameta answers na baribekagutte the next question the metals which can catch the fire easily when exposed to air options are sulfur magnesium sodium and calcium among this which metal is uh, catching the fire easily when it is exposed to the air the right answer is option c that is sodium sodium is very highly reactive metal when you keep it open in the air it will easily catches the fire okay so do share the videos with your friends also children this will definitely help for all of you the next question identify the following item which does not form any flame which is not going to form the flame out of these four candle it for, it forms flame right magnesium ribbon when we burn it forms flame what about charcoal it does not form flame what about kerosene stove it will forms the flame so the right answer here is option c charcoal okay charcoal is the one item it does not form any kind of flame when we burn it 
the next question guitar strings are made up of metals find the property of the metal guitar strings why do they may use metals to make the guitar strings okay because of the malleability or sonorous wood conductors are lustrous what is mean by malleability metals can be beaten into thin sheets p is nothing but sound producing property wood conductors they they are the good conductors of uh, electricity lustrous that means they have the shining property so which property is used in the guitars to uh, use uh, why they are using metals in the guitars to make the strings because they produce the sound okay right answer is option b sonorous okay sonorous is the right option for this okay yes then go for next question unburnt carbon particles causes what do they causes unburnt carbon particle causes do they cause stomach infections or respiratory problems brain infections or throat problems what do they cause okay they cause p that is respiratory problems because they release the toxic gases by releasing the toxic gases they cause the respiratory problems they cause the respiratory problems okay very good fine the next question uh, most of you are trying to answer very good the 15th question the metal which can be cut easily with the help of knife which metal is no easily uh, can be cut with the help of knife options are mercury magnesium sodium and potassium the easily which can be cut with the help of knife the that is option c sodium okay sodium can be easily cut with the help of knife sodium can be easily cut with the help of knife the next question the type of chromosomes present in the male gamete what kind of chromosomes are present in the male gamete you have to tell me children okay the options are x x chromosome x y chromosome x y y chromosome x y y with the capital letter chromosome what kind of chromosomes are present in the male sarita has given the right answer first first correct so the male gamete contain option b that is x y chromosome very good sarita okay fine the next question the mode of reproduction followed by this organism so this is given when uh, when we look at the kalika chetarike you can observe that there are so many examples given for asexual mode of reproduction okay so it's very important to know the mode of reproduction followed by this organism is that is options are regeneration budding spore formation and fission the right answer here is option b spore formation because this is a fungi okay this structure is the fungi what is the name of this structure it is called as rhizopusidon study more about this in class 10 standard okay we call this as rhizopus and this is a fungi what is this rhizopus called as this is called as a fungi and this will help in forming the spores clear yes the next question fusion of male sex cell with the female sex cell results in the formation of what when the male sex cell fuses with the female sex cell it results in the formation of what options are zygote embryo fetus and blastocyst now who will see let me see who will give the right answer for this the first answer is as given by hamid but it's not right not right answer okay yes let me tell you the answer okay again you have given the right answer fine see the fusion of male sex cell with the female sex cell firstly result in the formation of a zygote which is a single celled organism it is called as the single celled organism okay yes after zygote embryo will form after embryo it is fetus what is blastocyst actually when this zygote it you know that means one cell will divide to form two cell two cell to form again four cell so this kind what happen the cell division takes place it is cell divide agate so mass of cells will be formed so this is called as blastocyst this called as blastocyst okay yes the next question amoeba has no definite shape unlike other organisms it keeps on changing its shape the projections of varying lens protruding out of its body is referred to what okay what do we call pseudo spelling you check it pseudopodia and pseudopodia pseudopodia and mucus among this four which is correct answer you have to check out there are three pseudopodias which among these three are correct option c is correct p is silent here for pseudopodia 
S U D O P O D I A is pseudopodia. Here P is silent. Okay. Yes. Let's go for twentieth multiple choice question. Delhi Transport Corporation's world largest eco-friendly CNG bus service is the picture. Okay. So observe the picture. If you observe the picture, how the able mode of transportation help the environment using public transport system or a pet. You have to check out the check. Okay. Picture. See. Observe the picture. How the above mode of transportation help the environment? Options are whether it is helping using public transport which consumes petrol in reducing the pollution level, or public transport which runs based on CNG is eco friendly, or using public transports create more pollution. None of the above is my option. Why? What is this picture representing? What is this picture representing? So Hamid has given the right answer. Correct. See. The right answer is public transport which runs based on the CNG. What is meant by CNG? It is nothing but the compressed natural gas. CNG is nothing but the compressed natural gas. See now, we have the compressed natural gas in a bird. See, vehicles in a run mart. See, we have again another. It releases very less smoke. Very less smoke is released, so it does not cause more pollution to environment. So it is environment friendly. Hence, it is called environment friendly. So do watch all the four question papers which have been done for class eight students, and you get out of four children definitely because maximum concepts I have covered in this. Yes. So let's now go for the next question. Look at the next now. We are entering into question answer section. Most of the students are telling, "Ma'am, ah, uh, we are not able to follow your handwriting. I don't know whether I write so like in vigilant. I don't know because I am writing very vigilantly so that every students have to." Uh, make it a note that these question answers are definitely important. I took these question answers from, you know, the Kalika Chetri K part, and some of them are from the in, uh, textbook part. All the four papers which I did for class eight board examination, all the questions are different. Okay, and you know that will definitely give you more more ideas. So please note down the answers for all the questions which I am going to teach you from here onwards. The question is mention the methods. Which we need to follow to take care of our eyes. See, how do you take care of 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 your eyes? First point, what do you write, children? So you write, do not see. I may be slow in writing, but this is definitely going to help you. Okay, so do not look at the sun. Do not look at the sun. Okay, do not look at the sun or a powerful. Do not look at the sun or a powerful. Note down the answers, children. Or powerful light directly. Powerful light directly. This is the one way that you can, you know, keep your eyes safe. Second way is never rub your eyes. You should never rub your eyes. Okay. So when you should not rub your eyes, also you must know. You should never rub your eyes if if the dust particles. Okay. Never rub your eyes if the dust particles enter enter. So instead, what you have to do? Instead, you have to wash your eyes. Instead, wash your eyes. Wash your eyes with clean water. Wash your eyes with clean water. This is what you have to do. Okay. So two methods that we need to follow to take care of your eyes. Understand? Yes. Okay. So, but one more point. The students are telling it's correct. Yes. Not read the books in the dim light. Okay, that is also a correct one. Very good. So let's go for option. Nim gave you note the alba model paper note the alba order paper note that the prati question go option ide. Okay, optionally who yau the other question and select mark condoni vein mark budu attend mark budu right. So you need a model paper it in an unplanned mark budu. See what are illuminated objects and the kelta that what are illuminated objects? See the objects, the objects. Which shine? Okay, the objects which shine, the objects which shine due due to the the objects which shine due to the light light of other objects. The objects which shine due to the light of other objects light of other objects are called as they are called as. Illuminated objects. Illuminated is nothing but shining. Okay, they are called as 
shining object they are called as illuminated note down mark koli answers now example kelidare give an example for it so you can take see earth's moon our moon is a natural satellite right so earth's moon it receives the light it receives it receives the light from whom it receives the light from the sun from sun an example okay yes let's go for next question how does lightning conductor work hege work agutte lightning conductor anta kelidini where does the device is placed during the construction so lightning nan point wise baritini nimge easy agutte odkolakke hagene note down maadkoli okay the lightning lightning conductor okay so en maadutte lightning can strike lightning can strike telephone cards okay lightning can strike the telephone cards can strike the telephone cards and also electrical wires electrical wires and also electrical wires okay hence hence okay hence um uh, so uh one small change children small change take out this answer there is a small change i am writing the precautions first okay rather than write, writing the precaution firstly i would like to write the how does lightning conductor work on small change okay make it how does lightning conductor work first i should write okay see lightning conductor write down write down lightning conductor lightning conductor protect first you should write protection okay lightning conductor protect how does it protect you have to write first so you it protect the buildings lightning conductor protect the buildings it protect the buildings from protect the buildings from the effect of lightning what you have to write for this effect of lightning so firstly you have to write how does lightning conductor work okay lightning conductor protect the buildings from the effect of lightning okay so where does this device is placed you have to write now so this device this device this device is placed this device is placed taller than it place it taller than the building is place it taller than the building taller than the building in the walls of building taller than the building in the walls of building in the walls of building okay sorry at the beginning i started to write the precautions okay so we are going to write the precautions later okay yes so now lightning conductor protect the buildings from the effect of lightning is the answer for first question and followed by the device how where it is placed it is placed taller than the building in the walls of building they have placed this device okay yes so next question is mention the precautions now i have to write the precautions okay i thought two questions are joined and i have answered first so mention the precautions uh, precautionary measures that has to be followed inside the house against the lightning safety how do you uh, you know uh, take the precautions when lightning is uh, taking place inside the house you have to write here firstly you write lightning can strike the telephone cards okay so lightning you have to write lightning can strike lightning can strike lightning can strike telephone cards can strike the telephone cards okay and electrical wires and electrical wires can strike the telephone cards and electrical wires so what you have to do hence hence contact should be avoided so contact with this should be avoided okay contact with this should be avoided should be avoided this is the one way okay secondly second point what do you write electrical appliances electrical appliances like tv fridge washing machine okay electrical appliances 
electrical appliances should be unplugged okay electrical appliances should be unplugged it should be unplugged okay these are the two ways you can write any ways which you know in the examination minimum two ways i am teaching here okay these are the two ways that you have to follow inside the house against the lightning safety okay yes let's go for next question how does an acid rain cause is the next question see how does the acid rain cause you have to write see how does acid rain cause first of all you must know see there are toxic gases children there are toxic gases like there are toxic gases like nitrogen dioxide and sulfur dioxide okay in the atmosphere the atmosphere okay when these gases so when these gases when these gases combine with when these gases combine with rain water when it combine with rain water it forms it forms nitric acid the formula is hno3 and also sulfuric acid the formula is h2so4 you can write in words also okay it results it results it results in acid rain formation results in acid rain formation it results in the acid rain formation okay and the next question they are asking here is name one method that you can follow to reduce the acid rain what is the method that you can follow to reduce the acid rain see we can reduce the acid rain we can we can reduce the acid rain we can reduce the acid rain okay by reducing by reducing how can you reduce by reducing the use of by reducing the use of coal and petroleum by reducing the use of coal and petroleum okay yes next question children mention the characteristics of a good fuel so idana nimge school allu kuda hel kotirtare what are the characteristics of a good fuel a good fuel a good fuel a good fuel is readily a good fuel is readily it is readily available it is readily available and also it is cheap okay and it burns easily it burns easily a good fuel will burn easily with moderate with moderate rate with moderate rate okay this is the second point you have to write and thirdly it produces large amount of heat you can write this point it produces it produces large amount of heat a good fuel can produce large amount of heat okay and next it does not leave any residue behind it does not does not leave it does not leave any residue it does not leave any residue behind so these are some of the characteristics of a good fuel okay point number 1 point number 2 point number 3 and point number 4 next question name the hormones secreted by the adrenal gland and also the pancreas the adrenal gland adrenal gland adrenal gland it secretes a hormone called as adrenaline adrenaline hormone is secreted pancreas okay pancreas you must write the full sentence pancreas secretes a hormone called as insulin in last paper i have told you what is the purpose of adrenaline and insulin okay so the next question encouraging the adolescent for early marriage and pregnancy may cause the serious problems this kind of question may be asked okay encouraging the adolescent for early marriage and pregnancy idana skill based question anta kelta heltare okay na ee rithi question na nim exam alli keltare encouraging the adolescent for early marriage and pregnancy can cause serious problems justify anta keltare what do you write answer because because a girl because a girl who is a girl who is below 18 years below 18 years below 18 years is not prepared she has not 
prepared she has not prepared physically she has not prepared physically and also mentally she has not prepared physically and mentally for pregnancy okay she has not prepared physically and mentally for pregnancy that is the one thing and it may also results okay it may also results in health problems may also result in the health problems okay health problems for both mother and baby if that girl is going to give a give birth to a baby it is problem for both her that is a mother and also her baby it is problem for both okay that's why we should not encourage the adolescent for their early marriage and also for their pregnancy it's very problem okay yes next mention some of the measures taken by the government uh, to protect the taj mahal i'm asking okay so for this question what do you write answer for this question see the government has ordered government have to write down in the examination government ordered government ordered the industries government ordered the industries okay it has ordered the industries near taj near near taj nothing but taj mahal okay to switch to the to switch to switch to clean fuel switch to clean fuel clean fuel like like lpg and cng okay the one uh, industries and the factory who are nearby the taj mahal have to switch to the clean fuel like liquid petroleum gas and also the compressed natural gases second point automobiles that means the vehicles okay automobiles should switch to automobiles should switch to automobiles should switch to unleaded petrol they have to switch to unleaded petrol this is the second thing they have to uh, follow which has been ordered by the government okay this is very important yes so next question let's go for next question children see what is smog and how it is formed is my next question what is smog how do you answer what is smog the smog is a poisonous air children what is smog smog is a smog is a poisonous air we say smog is a poisonous air pollutant is the smog is a poisonous air pollutant which is formed by which is formed by which is formed by combination is formed by the combination combination of smoke and fog is formed by the combination of smoke and fog okay so what do fog contain the fog contain the fog contain tiny it contain tiny water particles it contain tiny water particles okay so when these tiny part uh, water particles when they combine when these combine when these when these combine when these combine with smoke when these combine with smoke okay which contain which contain which contain toxic gases which contain toxic gases like like nitrogen dioxide and sulfur dioxide fog is formed smog is formed okay very easy and important to remember how is smog formed smog is actually a poisonous air pollutant it is formed by the combination of what smoke and fog is called smog so what do smog fog contain fog contain tiny water particles and when these tiny water particles combine the smoke which contain the toxic gases like nitrogen dioxide and sulfur dioxide this smog is formed okay so the next question what is electroplating so what is electroplating it's very simple process of what is electroplating it is a process of depositing process of depositing a layer of process of depositing a layer of desired material a layer of 
desired material a layer of desired material on another material on another material on another material okay is called is called electroplating it is called as electroplating what is electroplating it is the process of depositing a layer of desired material on another material it is called as electroplating so next question in category why chromium plating is done for car parts so why do we do chromium plating the chromium has a shiny appearance chromium chromium has actually a shiny appearance chromium has shiny appearance okay and it does not and it does not it does not corrode and damage easily chromium does not corrode or damage easily it resist the scratches it also it resist it resist the scratches it resist the scratches so these are the some reasons that why are we choosing the chromium for plating the car parts and also the bath caps chromium is having the shiny appearance it does not corrode easily and it also resist the scratches next why does an end, uh, why does one end of led bulb is longer than another so it is given in your textbook okay you have to focus on all this minute minute things okay so why do we use the longer hand See, because the longer hand the longer hand of the led bulb okay the longer hand is what it is positive terminal of a battery the longer hand is the positive terminal of a battery as it is a positive terminal of battery okay so the led bulbs uh, one end of the led bulb is longer see if, if we cannot identify if both the end are of same size if, if both uh, both the end are of same size one hand is longer we can identify which is positive and which is negative so your longer hand is positive whereas the shorter hand is the negative okay yes let's go for next question what are artificial satellites name the natural satellite of the earth okay what are artificial satellites see the man made satellites we call it as man made satellites man made satellites okay they are called as man made satellites or called artificial satellites they are called as artificial satellites okay they are called as artificial satellites which is the natural satellite of the earth natural satellite of the earth any guesses children natural satellite of the earth natural satellite of the earth earth is what is the moon moon is the natural satellite of the earth next question i have asked earth appears blue from the sky why due to reflection it is due to due to the reflection okay due to the reflection of light due to the reflection of light from from the water due to the reflection of light from the water the earth appears blue from the face okay yes so these are some of the questions children the last question which i am asking here is the draw a neat table diagram of the human eye so you need to draw the human eye structure okay uh, and also you want to label you want to label the following parts see here some of the parts i have asked here is ciliary muscle iris and cornea i think everybody have learned how to draw the heat labeled structure of the eye okay so if you have not yet learned please do learn the structure of eye and also learn to label all the parts okay so idu uh, these are all some of the questions you know that uh, which i have been prepared for uh, the practice paper 4 students so far you have uh, got four practice papers from my side so keep all the four practice papers and just get ready for the examination and from next week i will be teaching you something more important uh, which will give build up your confidence level in double time so that you no know, whatever the question they ask in the examination definitely you can answer okay i hope you found this entire video useful if you find this video useful children don't forget to like and don't forget to share
this videos with your friends okay uh, this is definitely going to help for all of you do share the video with your friends and uh, till your examination completes i will be with you and we will also shortly start training the maths for your public examination thank you so much for being in live my dear students i hope you found this video useful and you can drop all your comments in the comment area so now you are uh, chatting in the chat section iga video complete aadmele new comment box nalli nimma opinions ana post maadi fine exam kandita difficult iralla it will be definitely easy the only thing what you have, have to do here is whatever i am training do follow it just definitely all get definitely all you all of you will get good marks yes question paper telegram group nalli nan share maartini those who are not in the telegram group do join the telegram group so neel ivaga telegram group ki join aadre eight students nimma eighth ninth and tenth ee three years ge nan nimge help maartini okay eighth standard students yaar ee video na nodta idira so neevu iga telegram group ke join aadre eighth ninth and tenth up to tenth nan nimge complete aagi help maartini science alli okay so thank you so much children have a nice day